Hi everyone and welcome to CodeFriend. Today I'm going to show you how to integrate a chat GPT window directly on Unity. This allows you to interact with the AI without having to go through the web interface. This works with a small plugin that I discovered a few days ago. I find it very practical and I thought I'd share it with you. This window can be used to converse with the AI about anything really. Your conversation doesn't necessarily have to be related to Unity. The plugin's implementation is very fast and simple. Be careful, however, this plugin only works on Unity 2022 and above. Notion Theory has developed this plugin and it is available for free on GitHub. The link is in the description. He had the excellent idea of packing the plugin into a Unity package file, so we only have to download one file, which is this one. Click on this file and then click download on the right. Once downloaded, open the file with Unity, a window will appear. You can leave everything checked, we'll need everything, and just click import. You may have a few warnings in the console, because of the import, but this is totally normal. Now that the plugin is installed, we need an API key to use ChatGPT. This is very simple, you can go into Edit, Project Settings. On the left, you will find an unusual menu, which is Unity Chat GPT. This entry has been added by the plugin, so you can select it. And on the right, there is only one field to fill, API key. To get an API key, you can go to platform.openai.com slash account slash API keys. I've added the link in the description directly. You need to have an OpenAI account. If you already use ChatGPT web interface, you probably already have one. Otherwise, you just have to create one. This is completely free. Once logged, you can go back to the link I gave you and you should have a similar page. This page allows us to create an API key, which will then allow us to communicate with ChatGPT from outside of its web interface. In our case, Unity. It is very important not to share your API key because it is linked to your account. So anyone with this key can impersonate you. Let's create our key. I already have one, as you can see, but it doesn't matter, we can have multiple ones. So use the button, create a new secret key. As I told you, this API key must not be shared with anyone. To make this tutorial easier to follow, I'm not blurring mine, but I will delete it after my recording session. We can now copy this key. There is a button for that just next to it and we can paste it into our API key field in Unity. Now everything is ready and we can go into the NTY menu, which is named after the developer of the plugin, and you can choose the only option Unity Chat GPT. This opens a window with a slightly more archaic design than the one we are used to when using Chat GPT web interface. The upper part here will contain the response of the AI and just below, this is our prompt. This is where we type what we want to tell the AI. For example, I can ask ChatGPT to give me a script allowing me to move a character around. I then send my prompt and here we go. A waiting icon will appear, depending on the API load, depending on your potential ChatGPT subscription, etc. The waiting time can be a bit long. But usually, after a few seconds, we receive a response from the AI with the usual format. So, a small introduction with the context, the script I asked for, and a few explanations of how it works. So this script should work, I will test it in a second. Just know that this window behaves the same way as any other Unity window, so you can attach or detach it, resize its width, height, etc. So let's quickly try this script, I've set up everything needed, I press play, and everything seems to work as intended. So mission accomplished. 
I'm sure this plugin will please many of you. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this video and make sure to subscribe if you're into Unity. This channel is filled with tutorials and videos about game development. I'm pretty sure you'll like my content, so please consider it. Enjoy this plugin and I'll see you very soon. Cut friend out.